Hey there, I'm Christian from Les Artisans d'Azur, and welcome to Do It Yourself, the basic leather adventurer's kit. Let's focus on the short scabbard, an essential tool for any hero who enjoys having free hands. We'll need the 9 ounce leather rectangle, the 5-6 ounce leather belt strap, and a few rivets. Let's cut out the PlayStation Remote lookalike with leather scissors or a utility knife. It is best to cut thick leather with our ergonomic knife, trying to keep the blade at a right angle to avoid seeing the underpart appear under the flesh of the leather. For the holes, let's use our 3.5mm hole punch while on a wooden board. This will protect the blade as well as the table underneath. Once done, we can use our leather groover to create a decorative line along the side of the sheath. Single or double line, simply adjust the width of the branch and lean along the side of the leather. These six holes will be decorative rivets, use 8mm feet. With the anvil and the hammer, you can close the rivet flat or domed if you have a rivet setter. This thick leather can be rolled up to make the next step easier. Don't worry, this is tough leather. For those who use foam swords, we suggest rounding the inside edges with an edge beveler to protect your blade. The model seen here is left-handed since it will be worn on the right side. The belt strap's direction will determine if you create a right or left-handed model. We'll use 9mm feet to fix the pieces together. Here, we are making a right-hand scabbard. Double-check this step before closing your rivets. Now close the first row of rivets on the anvil. Next, roll the leather so that the second row lines. You can use the smaller tip of the anvil to close them. And victory! You've made your short scabbard. Now fill it with your favorite weapon and go fight evil. Hey, have a good one.